everyone, it's Kate here from Secret Bloggers Business and welcome to Blog Tip Tuesday where you get weekly tips and tricks for a better blog. Now this week I've got a super quick trick on how you can make the most of your successful newsletter content. So this is email newsletters that you've sent before that you've maybe got a good open rate or a good engagement rate or that people have you know hit reply and responded to. So you know that they did well, you know that was good content and now it's done, it's gone and no one's ever going to see it again and that's kind of a little bit sad. So there's two things that you can do with it to make sure that that awesome content never dies. One is I would actually take that content and obviously this is up to you if that content's relevant. I take it, maybe tweak it a little and maybe use it as a Facebook post. Longer form Facebook posts are doing really well at the moment. Um, you might even do it just as a pure way of getting engagement. People love reading a story, particularly if you're not then trying to like get something out of them. So I do this on a Sunday. I have a regular post, which is normally like a longer, more, you know, sharing a personal story type of thing. So using newsletter content, which is also kind of normally in that similar form, well, it is for me anyway, it just makes sense. So all you have to do is go copy paste a few tweaks, pop it in and boom, you've got an awesome Facebook post that's going to get tons of engagement. You can, of course, also use that newsletter post, sorry, use that newsletter again in your nurture sequence. So if you've got a nurture sequence set up for when new subscribers sign up, I would normally really highly recommend that people try and add in their best ever emails into that sequence. Again, obviously you might have to tweak it to make sure it makes sense all year round, but you already know that that newsletter did well. So why not reuse it? It seems a shame to waste it if you ask me. So that's it. That's my tip. That's how you can take your awesome content that you've already done the hard work for and make it work even harder. If you've got any other tips around this, pop them below. I'd love to hear them. If you like this video, then please share it or please come and subscribe over at our YouTube channel at Secret or head to secretbloggersbusiness.com for more tips, more blogging info. We've got oodles of great stuff over there as well as quite a few freebies which will really help take your blogging to the next level. So come on over and check it out and I'll see you all next week for more Blog Tip Tuesday. Bye.